Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I got me some Chick-fil-A. I just went through the drive-thru just now. We're gonna be trying the new honey chicken pimento cheese sandwich. Um, it's been out for a while now. It's been like a couple weeks, I'm pretty sure. And I'm not gonna lie, I already tried it. Okay, so I've tried it. Um, the only thing is, I don't really know how I felt about it because it was sitting in the car for a little bit, so it wasn't as fresh as I would like it to be. But today, I'm gonna try it fresh. Fresh, fresh, fresh. Okay, so. I just got the meal, so I got fries, of course. Let's put it up there for a minute. They've been giving mints now, which is kinda nice. Which I also got a fruit cup too, which I will show you later. Um, why did I get fruit, you're wondering? Um, we need some balance in this meal. And, yeah. We gotta balance it with some fruit, so. I got a Sunjoy. So before we jump into today's video, I want to talk about today's sponsor, which is Temu. And I'm sure everybody's heard of the brand Temu by now. I mean, there's ads about it everywhere on social media. It is an online affordable shopping website and they have some pretty good deals that you can't really find anywhere else. So you guys, everything they sent me. First thing, I'm just grabbing random stuff. A humidifier, very colorful. When you turn it on, and I always recommend you like filtered water, but yeah. dish towels or just like hand towels, whatever you would like to use them for. They're just gray and white. And I don't know, you can never go wrong with towels. I definitely needed some. This is basically for your stove. I feel like this would make everything a lot cleaner and easy to clean up. Like a frother? Yeah, like a milk milk frother. Um, it says cappuccino maker. But yeah, it's super cute, tiny, and can't wait to use this for dressings and coffee. Basically, a it comes with two um, for cleaning your windshield. Because if you think about it, like, a lot of people don't really care to clean the inside of their windshield. So this is perfect for that. So it looks like this, and you basically just like clean your windshield or just like your car windows, anything. This is a lint remover because sometimes I feel like just the regular lint rollers don't really do much. So hopefully this helps with pet hair or just any hair, honestly. Electronic luggage scale. So I really wanna do a lot of traveling next year. So hopefully this um, it saves me money. The black box traffic recorder. It's like a dash cam for your car. I got a like coat rack thing, which you can actually put so many things on this. I got another one in black as well. Save as much space as possible in my closet, so this will be super easy. I got a door draft stopper. And I got this, which is basically, I don't know what you would call this, but um, it's like tape almost. So you kind of tape it around your like toilet got a eyebrow hair trimmer nose hair trimmer sort of thing because why not and then i got a cute little halloween sponge for dishes because honestly it was cute and it's a pumpkin and it's pink i got these little washing balls so basically you just throw these in the wash and it should get rid of hairs and all that stuff so I got a magic cleaner gel. There's like those really hard to reach areas. So this is so easy to clean all that stuff out with. So mini trash can for your car. Love this, it's so cute. A car vacuum cleaner and I've tried it out already and it's amazing. I have, I'm not sure what this is. I will put a description right here. Like I know what everything is besides this. So I'll let you guys know, but <laughs> that was pretty much it. That's all the stuff that I got from Temu. I do have a discount code for you guys, which I will put right here on the screen. But yeah, let's get started with this mukbang. I know we're hungry. I'm hungry too. And I literally just had lunch. Okay, let's try this sandwich. Um, I'm like parked somewhere kind of hidden and this man decided to park right next to me and I was like no but I think he's just going to work so we're chilling anyway let's look at the sandwich real quick so I feel like kind of different I'm not wearing my crazy fake lashes today that looks good okay it's actually pretty fresh now that I'm like holding it this is this looks so good so honey pimento cheese there's like jalapenos in here that looks so good. Let's take a bite. Let's take a thumbnail and then we'll take a bite. Let's take a good bite. 
This is like pretty messy, I'm not gonna lie. Let's see. Okay. It's definitely better this time versus the last time I had it. You know, that's pretty good. The jalapenos are not really that spicy, which I kind of wish they were, but. Mmm. This is not bad. I am new to like pimento cheese though. I've never had that before. Mm. I think it's more of like a southern thing, right? You guys let me know. But I don't know if this sandwich is going to fill me up and those fries. Last time I had this sandwich, I was actually pretty sick. So I couldn't really tell if I liked it or not, which sucks. But oops. Their fries are so good. I don't care what anybody tells me. Honestly, the sandwich is really good, but it's very different, I'd say. Like, it doesn't remind me of a Chick-fil-A sandwich. You guys let me know what you think about it. I think it's only limited edition, for now at least. It's pretty good though. Mmm. I'm tasting the honey a lot more now. Oh. I think my fries just fell. Oh, okay. I saved them guys, they were good. They landed on this piece of paper. Thank God. That sandwich definitely does not need any more sauce, which is nice. Cause, ooh. Because <clears throat> the cheese is so flavorful. Ooh, that sauce like went the back, went to the back of my throat. Honestly, Sunjoy is so good, but the sweet tea can be a little too strong, or a little too sweet, sorry. It's okay though. I literally went to the gym twice yesterday. Twice. I had no clue what to do. I was so bored, and I was like, okay, I went to the gym, waited like four or five hours, and then I went back. And no, I didn't work out the same muscle group. No, I did not. Um, but I don't feel too exhausted anymore. I feel like the more obviously you work out, the less sore you're gonna feel like the, the day after. Cause I did, let's see. Back and buys. I do cardio first, like 10 minutes, and then I did back and buys, and I had a very, very good workout. Because I took pre-workout too, so that's another reason. Um, I usually don't take pre-workout. I usually don't, but I've noticed recently it gives me that extra boost that I just need. So, I might start taking it more, I might start taking it less, I don't know. But as of right now, 
I definitely do like pre-workout. I don't want to take creatine though. I don't know. You guys let me know if you take any creatine. We're talking about working out while I'm eating Chick-fil-A. Balance. It's balance, guys, okay? Mm -hmm. The jalapenos are so good in this. They're like more sweet than anything. With like a little kick. I don't know. This tastes way better fresh. Last time I had it, I was probably sitting there for like 15 minutes before I ate it, so. I'm sure that's like that for everything, but I prefer eating my food like super hot and fresh. Okay, I'm gonna try this with some Chick-fil-A. Cause why not? Mmm. That was pretty good. I'm just gonna have a cup of fruit. <laughs> Definitely not organic. But neither neither was this meal, so it doesn't really matter to me anymore. Like, if I'm cooking at home, I prefer it to be organic. Because it is better for you. I don't care what anybody says. <laughs> so it looks like there's strawberries, little mandarin oranges. These blueberries, which are humongous. And then... Apple. This is probably so boring to watch. I'm sorry. <laughs> I plan on working out after this, so. I usually eat fruit in the morning. I don't really eat it in the afternoon. Because technically, yes, I think it is better for you in the morning. But the way I see it is like, okay, you have to eat fruit in the morning, right? Because it's bad to have it throughout the day because of the sugar. But I'm like, what about eating like a candy bar during the day? Like which, which is b better for you during the day? Candy bar or fruit, you know? So I used to be so like straight with my diet about certain things like that. Like, like no eating after 6 p.m. and no red meat and... No fast food, I did that for a while. No food after... Afternoon, I think, I don't know. But... Although I will say, like, I definitely... Saw results quicker that way, but... Like, there's certain things that your body needs. Like, certain nutrients, and... I wasn't paying attention to that, so I got very anemic. Because I wasn't eating red meat, which does have a lot of iron. And my dummy self didn't know, hey, iron is very important. You guys should definitely try that sandwich out. If you like pimento cheese, if you've never had it, give it a shot. But I will continue getting it until um, they just don't sell it anymore, which I'm gonna be really sad about because that was so bomb. That was so good. I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.